Liberty General Insurance is uh, completing its 10 years. Let's see what the CEO and uh, whole time director, Mr. Ruben Masthana, has to say about this wonderful journey and the company's growth strategy. So 10 years ago, we, we started uh, Liberty General Insurance. So Liberty Mutual, who is our foreign promoter, has been uh, the backbone of the operation and has been very helpful uh, in, in setting up the company for us and, and bringing us uh, to this spot. My colleagues uh, and my team and I have been extremely fortunate uh, to have got the opportunity to set up uh, an insurance company from scratch. Uh, so the 10 years, uh, you know, I think we are still a very young company uh, and we have a long way to go. Our focus has been on two basic things. The first thing is, is basically uh, to generate or to create a company which people can say is a company of good people doing good things. And we wish to sustain that culture as we go ahead because we want everybody to look at us and say, you know, these are good people to do to work with. If you look at it from a financial point of view, you know, we are very focused on what I call sustainable, profitable growth. We are looking at growing in this market uh, about two to three times of the market growth and gaining market share. And our ultimate ambition is to create a substantial insurance company in India which is not just large but also profitable. We are here at the right time in the right industry at the right place. I think this is an industry which provides a lot of good to people. You know this is an industry which provides succor to people in their time of need, assistance to them in their time of need and this is uh, where I see huge potential for growth and for innovation. We have a very progressive and a very pro proactive regulator who is looking at the long-term benefits of the industry and is, is, is looking at regulatory changes which will make this industry more customer friendly and at the same point in time help penetrate insurance uh, into the far corners of the country. What I believe is if you look at in terms of under penetration of the insurance industry in India while our large cities are reasonably well penetrated uh, it's the tier 2, tier 3 rural, semi-rural areas of the country where I think the penetration of uh, insurance is very scarce. And the, the, the best part is that this is actually the areas where there is a need for insurance. Because this is an area where we have our farmers, where we have our agricultural producers, where we have people who are self-employed professionals who need help in time of need. And I think insurance can be that support which can provide them that assistance uh, when they need it. So I believe that over the next few years we will see substantial growth in terms of insurance penetration in small town India and in rural India. But at the same point in time the industry will have to be proactive, will have to be innovative and will have to bring out products which come at a low price with easy claim settlement processes. And that is I believe the secret uh, for growth of the industry in the longer term. A short break after this segment, but lots more on the other side. 20